So John's yeah. shoulders are just too big and manly, right? So nothing I'm work doing here is working. All right, I got myself nice and low. I squeeze and I can't finish it. I get my knee up belly. I'm squeezing, I'm squeezing, I can't finish it. Fine. I'm going to give up this control of him, right? Give up most of the main defenses and allow him to try to do them in the gamble that I'm going to get him first, right? Because when I'm doing a head and arm choke here, if John can get his arms around his leg next to my body, it's going to be really hard for me to finish this. So before he can do that, I've got my knee in there. I'm pushing that leg away. I'm going to flatten my hips <coughs> to the ground and squeeze. Right? So I finish from mount, finish from knee on belly, finish from side control. Cool? And then if he's still not tapping, then I start walking around, bringing my ear to his ear, start walking away from his body. Okay? Not very often do you have to go to the side control one. But if you do, especially on people with long necks, smaller shoulders, it's going to be a little bit different. Cool? What's up? So that's me. I got a long neck. That's fine. <laughs> long neck, small girly shoulders. It's all right. It's not your fault. <laughs> cool? So finish from out, finish from knee on belly, finish from side control. Okay, make sure they don't pass out. Questions? Not, not much else changes. One, two, three.